I、uh, I experienced an immense series of light bulbs going off when I discovered Gabor Mate's work, and then when I discovered Bessel van der Kolk's work, specifically the Body Keeps the Score. And yet, when I opened, when I read the Body Keeps the Score, it was so evident to me that I was a trauma survivor. I had all the symptoms, but I didn't have a trauma that I could pin something onto. And then when I When asking my parents about it, I discovered all of the refugee trauma that was there for us. And yet, growing up in our household, there was simply benign neglect. And so, a part of me has been feeling like I'm looking for a trauma or traumas or abuse that perhaps doesn't exist. And it's only been in the last couple of years that I've actually unpacked the impact of racialized trauma. And the ways in which the invisible wounds of racialized trauma has impacted me psychically, psychologically, impacted how I move through the world as well as my worldview, which has then given me pause and has made me very passionate. About sharing about this into the world.